Hi, this is Jack Buffington for Hackaday.com. I'm going to show you the add command for EagleCAD schematic and layout. To add a part in EagleCAD, what you do is click on this button in the tool palette, or you can type in the command line, add. This brings up a dialog that has all of your libraries that you may have created before or they may have come directly from EagleCAD when you installed it. So let's, let's put a crystal in here. And I'm just going to pick this one at random. Uh, I'm going to click OK and just drop it in. And I can just drop as many as I want until I hit Escape and it brings me back to the dialog box, in which case I can now add something else. Here's a different crystal, and I'll click OK. So I've added a few of those. I'll hit Escape to get back to the dialog box, and if I hit Escape one more time, that finishes up the command. I'm no longer adding parts. If we go over to my layout, you can now see here are those parts that I just added. If I was creating a board that had no schematic, if I did say file new, um, actually, let me just delete these out of here and save. OK, it's telling me right here, no forward or back annotation will be performed. This means that I've just created a board, but I have another schematic open that isn't linked to it. But that's OK. That's what I wanted to do. Now I should be able to add parts. We're going to add a whatever this is here. And I can go ahead and do that now in layout. Oh, I went outside of the boundary of the board. If you have a schematic associated with this, you will not be able to do this command. That was the add command for EagleCAD schematic and layout. This is Jack Buffington for Hackaday.com.